some insurers that I've talked with are further ahead than others, admittedly. Um, many tier one and tier two insurers that I've worked with have created dedicated teams for exploring different claims automation use cases. Some of them have conducted innovation labs with participants that span many IT providers in our industry. So we get to work shoulder to shoulder with the customers as well as the other partners in the ecosystem. And the general objective of these dedicated teams, these dedicated initiatives, is to really reimagine the claims experience from the policyholder's perspective, while also considering the critical need for connectivity amongst various partner ecosystem solutions to optimize and innovate that claims experience. So it's bringing together a lot of solutions, orchestrating a lot of data, and that's very challenging for carriers to do because you know none of it is easy and many insurers are beyond eager to explore claims automation. They wanna leverage predictive models, large language models, machine learning. They wanna use open platforms. They of course need the sharing of data, which is critical to maximize the opportunities brought forth by today's technology landscape and those things that are coming in the future. So, you know, claims automation is one of those things that has the ability to address the three key things that claims organizations strive to do well. They want to bring customer satisfaction, they want to do expense management, and they want to have accurate indemnity. Few initiatives can positively influence all three areas, but claims automation is one of them. And in many cases, other initiatives can adversely impact one another, where they have to make a, you know, a choice is if I give greater service, then there's more LAE. Um, so we really see claims automation as an opportunity, a critical need brought forth with agility, cloud native integrations. Um, you really need that agility when you're thinking about invoking on this claims automation journey as well um, and leveraging you know, flexible um, partner ecosystems and integration mechanisms. Um, because, you know, it's probably you're not going to get it right the first time, may or not, may or may not get it right the second or third time. And it's you know, it's really going to be a never ending evolution when you think about claims automation and how you're going to want to iterate and continually make changes. And, you know, these new technologies are available to help you adapt quickly and to be able to really reinvent that claims experience um, in a very effective way.